everyone i hope you all are safe and doing good so the most awaited engineering campus hiring program from goldman sachs is back yes through this program actually uh, they hire interns as well as full time but this year it's something different right they are going to hire interns through this program and they run goldman sachs and this program every year this time it's their fifth year right so what is this program how they hire what is the process how to apply you know how to prepare for those like aptitude test or technical test right they conduct before uh, you know hiring interns and everything the eligibility criteria and everything you will get in this video right so they are hiring interns for 2025 may june 2025 right so it's basically 2025 engineering campus hiring program from goldman sachs and the registrations have already been started so last day to apply is uh 8th of september so apply as soon as possible eligibility is those who are in their pre final year means graduating in 2026 they can apply for this program and the date of joining is may june 2025 means means next year but for that you have to apply right now because it's a lengthy process and yeah the selection rate here at goldman sachs is you know it's almost negligible i mean you have to practice very hard you have to work hard you have to prepare for your apt technical round and then you will be getting selected for internship right so the location would be bangalore or hyderabad now see it's they are this program is in its their fifth year and the program basically focus on the curated course work mentorship and professional development opportunities so a particular a uh, proper course work would be there those you will complete and mentorship and you will have some opportunities for your professional development right so this program basically helps students to upskill themselves and to get a sneak peek into the life at goldman sachs and you also have some opportunities for interaction with business leaders through this program so what would be the process see now first you have to apply i mean registrations are open in august and september so till 8th of september please do registration for this program and then in september there will be aptitude aptitude test so the link you will get in your registered mail id the apt link the test link right and this is very crucial because 90% students would be you know out in this test only right so this test is crucial this phase i'll tell you how to you know uh, prepare for apt uh, test and what kind of questions will be asked in aptitude test then there would be coursework it will it will be a three week coursework after clearance of aptitude test right to upskill for the technical test so that would be in october and november and then a technical test would be conducted in november only for the candidates who successfully complete the coursework right then interviews would be conducted in november interview would be scheduled for the candidates clearing the technical test if you have cleared the technical test then interview and after that offer roll out right so in december and the internship would be started in may june 2025 right now see how to apply for this if you have more questions then you can uh, go to the faq section as well see these are the steps the link you will get in the description box of this video don't worry then you will click on the register button once you have registered then click apply after that you have to provide all the requested details and then click submit right please fill out all the details you know uh, correctly to get that aptitude test link fine all the mandatory fields are critical and need to be filled without errors right because these are non editable sections if you have any query you can just mail write a mail to this uh, email id or you can go to their faq document there are so many uh, faqs and you can just if you have any doubt you can just check out these faqs fine now the link you will get in the description box of this video once you click on that link you will be redirected here and then click on register and then click on apply apply now just provide your mail address here and then you will get a code on your mail id and after that you just have to you know uh, here upload your resume your cover letter your all the information and then submit next and then some more information and then submit like that's it you will get a uh, mail after you have successfully registered for this program right now what would be you know the number of questions in apt round and technical round that thing i'll show you so in the apt test total number of questions are 66 questions this information is based on the previous year question paper and all this is not anywhere you know officially in on their website allotted time will be 90 minutes and marking system is plus 5 for correct answer and minus 2 for incorrect answer so there there would be negative marking as well now the syllabus for apt test is quantitative aptitude numerical computation numerical reasoning then reasoning logical reasoning abstract diagrammatical uh, reasoning and verbal 
comprehension right number of questions from each section is from numerical computation eight number of questions and difficulty level is high numerical reasoning 12 questions logical reasoning 12 questions abstract reasoning 12 questions diagrammatic reasoning 12 questions and verbal 10 questions these both are of having high difficulty level these are medium and these are high this data is based on the previous year question papers right so this kind of questions you will get and these number of questions you will get in apt test fine now next would be technical round so total number of questions is 20 50 mcqs and then five subjective as well right those are related to you know the hr round kind of thing or a uh, situation practical situation would be given to you and what would be your you know answer in that kind of situation what you will do in that situation these kind of subjective questions right so negative marking is there in this also 135 minutes you will get plus 5 for correct mcq minus 2 for incorrect and plus 10 for correct subjective right there will be no negative marking in subjective questions right so now in technical round uh, you will be asked questions from see the coding questions quant then computer science mcqs then competitive programming or advanced programming questions and subjective questions so from coding two questions will be asked i mean uh, was asked in the previous year quant eight questions cs mcq seven questions advanced programming one question and subjective two questions so this is the difficulty level of all these so here basically you need to prepare oops concept dsa on the os dbms for cs mcqs right the basic or the fundamental computer science subjects though the mcqs from those would be asked right oops concept and all means you need to prepare very well for you know to clear for the safety and technical test to get internship at goldman Sachs. right so this is all about this internship now if you have any doubt or any question you can just let me know in the comment section right so now that's for this video now i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye take care